Ooh, Damien Dunlap. Sorry, my eyes are red. I need to take a nap. Today is December 4th, 2019. And the reason I'm doing this video is because I'm going to look back 12 months. 12 months. I'm making a, another video on this same date in 2020. It's the day before my birthday. So we're going to see if I meet my goals. I'm going to, this is my, for my fitness goals, and I'm going to lay, lay out for my, um, you know, financial goals. Well, so um, anyway, I got my planner. This is like my seventh one. They used to come bigger. They still got them bigger. And my book. Well, I got one more of these books. I need probably two more of these books. Um, besides, I have to write my pressure and um, what you call it, sugar down daily. I got to report my pressure. I think my appointment's tomorrow. I'm getting kind of confused. I should have wrote it when the man called me. So when I talked to the doctor the day before Thanksgiving, he said, you like this program. They check your pressure, blah, blah, blah. So I'm going to do that. And um, cause my pressure still is high. Um so um so December 5th, 2020, there's a show. So I got 12 months to get ready for a show. But starting tomorrow, I'm going to get ready for the show. I'm gonna I'm gonna get ready, drop some weight. Let my body rest for three weeks, then go right back into it until I get to my desired weight. I made a video before. So I'm thinking by me lowering my weight that my pressure will get under control. Okay, so um that's my my fitness goal until my, for my birthday. It's going to change everything. Matter of fact, I'm thinking about <clears throat> May hiring a coach. So, I'm a, the only thing about that is I have a gout and every time that I change my diet, even to the recommendation the doctor told me, I, I made a video about this, told me to become a um, vegetarian i changed it and then and he didn't even realize that uh the uh what the he suggests and i do cause the gout you know um so um peas asparagus uh causes gout a lot of natural stuff causes gout but um so um and the gout pills they give you the doctor message your kidneys up. So I'm in a uh, really bad situation. But hopefully, gradually, I need to gradually lose weight because losing weight too fast always need gout. Beans, which I love a lot, causes gout. I said this before. So I have everything I have. I have my planner book. I have my shaker cups. I got a whole bunch of these. I got about six of these. These, uh, not shaker cups, these um, for your protein. I have a whole bunch of shaker cups. I have some metal ones. Uh, any, I, every, like every company I see, I always get a shaker cup. I go into, um, I don't like those dollar shaker cups you get out the 99 cent store. Them things just thing top off of. So I usually support any company I usually see out there, check their shaker cup out. I don't think I'm gonna buy a metal shaker cup. They good to keep the smell down, but. The top seem to, after a while, doesn't, doesn't hold up very well. So anyway, I got a Coleman. It was holding up pretty good, so I'm going to buy another one of those. Uh, anyway, you'll see in the video. Also, I'm um, for sure, I'm doing a workout video. So I'm going, this is going to be open. You know, I'm going to do uncut. I'm not doing no editing, no kind of thing. It'll be from my phone. If you don't like it, I don't care. You know, this is me to look back on. And, um, and hopefully, I can inspire somebody else. 50 plus to, um, you know, keep on pushing. So anyway, 
I had a goal, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to make that goal. I wanted to rep uh, 225, 50 times. I think a year and a half ago, two years ago, I got 40 times. Um, so I'm that's still one of my goals, but my main goal is to get in tip-top shape like it's the end of the world, you know. So, you know, um, the only thing that besides the gout is my knees. And you know what I'm talking? You, know, <clears throat> you talk to older people that's older than me that's like 70 and 80, a lot of them people have knee surgery. Them people was going balls to the walls. I'm like, dang, you had knee surgery? And then even a couple female athletes, uh, older athletes, uh, they had knee surgery. I wouldn't even, it's one, one individual. She still go balls to the wall, you know. So anyway, um, I'm I'm gonna do hack. I'm gonna work around. I'm not doing no balls to the wall. So you ever see me squat? Which I like to squat um, because I don't like to be. I don't like none of my body to get sore, you know. So I know squat. My body say score for three or four days. So I'm gonna do squats. But I ain't going no balls to the wall and all that bull stuff. Um, Cause also last year, my rotator cup. Hurt, but I think that was when I was doing them. I mean, excuse me, a lot of benching, and I was probably benching too far up. Now I bench um, nipple, you know. Um, so I been that's been fairly actually I've been pretty fairly pretty good. Um, let me see what else about it. So I'm gonna take air skirts to this video so you can see for sure. And unless I'm in the hospital, December 5th, 2020, I'll be talking more about it probably in <clears throat> October. I'll be doing that show, you know. <clears throat> and either I can't walk and or I'm just dead, half dead, or some weird stuff come about. Uh, where I can't pay for the show, I'm financially broke, ruined, I would be there. So another thing is, um, people keep asking about Dave, Cam America, probably saying his name wrong. Um, you know, uh, people always ask me, we don't, they don't see us together. Well, well, one point he was getting ready to do a show. He had a bucket list and uh, he was getting ready for the show. I was like, okay, he, I let him get ready for the show. And I stepped back because I want him to blame me why he's not ready for the show. And um, I think during the summertime, I watch my sons. And I try to, um, my sons are young, so it's good, you know. I try to get them to exercise and help them with they, their school. Always give them, like, just even this Thanksgiving, they gave them a project. Like, dang, you for real? What if we decide to go across town? You got to do a project? Boarding? What's weird, dude? Crazy. Anyway, this is ranting. So, um. I, I don't have time to usually work out, but it's good because he's, he's he's younger than me. So he go hard, harder, and whatever. So what happened, it, it, it's funny, I just brought about the knees. The guy, uh, I forgot his name, an older gentleman, 80 some, I think 83, 84 years old, you know, good guy. He's like, he always get on me, man, what you on the phone? You taking too long between set. Well, I don't really, he's funny, very respectful guy. I love the guy. But anyway, he asked me what day was that, and I said, "Wow, you know, he's that was Wednesday. That was Wednesday last month, I believe." And I said, "Yeah, where's he at? Let me, let me try to reach him." Found out, came uh, spoke. You can see watch his video, but I'm gonna tell you why I was looking for him. And uh, his wife said, "Him yeah, been home." I'm like, "Who?" Um, it's so funny. So he she tells me this. I'm worried like something happened to him, like. Man, I mean, like, it's like a shock to me. Like, you know, when people do stuff that's not in a normal way of doing stuff, that's definitely not in a normal way of doing stuff, you're like, oh, man, and, and, and you care about the person. You're like, whoa, what's going on? You know, and I thought first she was joking, then she wasn't joking. And I said, oh, man. And then I get this call about he with a lady. I'm like, nah, this can't be real. This can't be Dave, you know. I seen Dave. First thing, this is all. Uh, this is not a joke, but it's the truth. I, I, 30, 30, I would say minimum thirty ladies 
he would say, I first thing come out of his mouth, I kid you not, I'm married. And and, and it's kind of funny now, but <laughs> people were talking that about that video. I can't believe that the first thing this I seen two ladies say this, first thing come out of his mouth, he's married. So that's that's kind of hard. Um, when you care about somebody and you see them them do something that you don't understand and to me is foolish. And the reason I'm saying it's foolish because not only left his wife to support him, to support every motherfucking thing he did that I seen. You know, this ain't no old, I seen, had this nigga's back, had his back. He just get up and left. And when you do that, you, 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 you kind of hurt good people. So, uh, if you don't have good attention with somebody, you should leave them alone, especially to people that got your back. Another thing is, I remember he quit the job. He left. He, he got the. He watch his video. I might put the link down there. I'm matter of fact, I'm put the link down there. He left his the job. He cried for. It. He was managing the Dave Fisher Gym and Torrance, a nice gym that you go in there and film. You see all. You see everybody in there. I seen cool. They filmed a movie there. Uh, I don't know. They do a lot of stuff there. I'm not a star struck guy. I don't care. I don't go to talk to people, bother people. I ain't caring about that. But uh, but if that's what you want to do, be a part of that, and you cry about it, you just get up and left over a lady, and you didn't really have a plan, a backup plan, you just get up and left. Whoop. And you have responsibility because you definitely accumulated bills with your, your wife. You know, and you left her hanging. You know, you left your job hanging. And then in that video, brother, you said um, it's between your wife. That's true. It's, it's definitely your wife and your girl, right? You're not married to me. You're not married to, to her. You know, you're not even divorced or officially, uh, legally, whatever. You also owe it to your f family members. Your friends, your gym family. What well, last month he made a video a month or two ago. You look it up on this page. If he did, I hope he didn't delete that. Of uh, he's gonna do a show with Mary. Mary, and you know Mary loved you, dude. And uh, there's a lot of people love you because they keep asking me and they can't believe you left them. And uh, <clears throat> so anyway. <sighs> <clears throat> uh, so anyway, so that's the take on that. So I'm knocking everything out. So I'm, it's December 5th, tomorrow. And so um, have a wonderful day. Your neighborhood, this video got kind of long. So anyway, mm, uh, <laughs> no, I also am not cutting my hair no time soon. I'm just going to, that's how I'm going to. Train, 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 train. And oh, I gotta get by jury duty. So my sister just did jury. She said she went there one day down there. So in Compton. So I'm gonna go do that jury duty down in Compton. Anyway, uh, anyway, I'm gonna say to you have a wonderful day in your neighborhood. And uh if you smell farts or gas, forgive me, because I'm taking all these supplements and I'm gonna show sure not be holding those gas in.